What is a star seed? Better yet, who is a star seed? If you trace the origins of human lineage, you end up with a plethora of questions. For example, if we were to believe the Bible's origins of mankind and assume that we came from Adam and Eve, then that assumption wouldn't explain the genetic differences in our population. Continuing with the Bible's story, we are led to believe that Noah and his family were the only survivors of the Great Flood, which means we are allegedly all descendants of Noah and his family. Are we to assume that Noah brought aboard two of every ethnicity as well? That's highly unlikely. Zechariah Sitchin believes our DNA was genetically manipulated, which remains a possibility, but why would the Anunnaki create various ethnicities instead of one slave race? That leads us to another more feasible possibility. We were seeded here from various star nations. In this premise, genetic and ethnic diversity is explained. It also covers the differences in our blood types, such as RH negative, RH positive, A, B, AB, and O blood types. Perhaps some star nations have people with predominantly red hair and freckles, while others have dark-skinned inhabitants. Maybe some, such as the Pleiadians, have blonde hair and blue eyes. It's also possible that Sitchin's premise is correct, while other star nations also seeded the planet with their genetic offspring. Perhaps we would look at ourselves differently if we saw a planet inhabited by various star nations, versus segregating ourselves from one another through patriotism, nationality, and prejudice. Is it possible that our planet is one gigantic galactic experiment to see how various star nations would get along with one another?